It's just one of the sentiments stirring up tea parties from coast to coast. They're patterned, of course, on that legendary protest in Boston back in 1773. But now T stands for tax enough already, and protesters are steamed about bailouts, too. See, and Susan Rosen getting a taste of that Chicago-style tea. Does that come with the pizza as well, too, Susan? Uh, well, you know, Kira, uh, this is a, a party for Obama bashers. I have to say that this is not entirely representative of everybody in America. This was organized by three different conservative groups. And if you look at some of the signs, Kira, let me let me introduce you to this guy. Uh, would you come over here with me, please? You know, what is this supposed to mean? What What do you mean by that? Well, I mean, he's a fascist. The pirates... Wait, why do you say he's pirates? a fascist? He's the president of the United States. He's a fascist. Do, do, you realize how, uh, do you realize how offensive that is? I think he's a fascist. Why? Because he is. He's what way can you say that? Because the real pirates are in, in, the, in the White House, in the Senate, and in the Congress. We need one-term limits for all these po elected politicians. Why be so hard on the president of the United States, though, with such an offensive message? Because he is. He's a fascist. Okay. All right. So, okay, we've got a fascist. All right. Uh, let's see. Drop the taxes. Drop socialism. Okay. Let's see. You're here with your two-year-old, and you're already in debt. Why are you here today, sir? Because I hear a president say that he believed in what Lincoln stood for. Lincoln's primary thing was he believed that people had the right to liberty, and they had the right Sir, what does this have to do with taxes? What does this have to do with your taxes? Do you realize that you're eligible for a $400 credit? Let me finish my point. Lincoln, Lincoln believed that people had the right to share in the fruits of their own labor and that government should not take it. And we have clearly gotten to that point. Wait, all right, wait. And did you, you know, that, did you know that the state of Lincoln gets $50 billion out of these stimulus. That's $50 billion for this state, sir. Ma'am, 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 I, 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 can you stop this, sir? Hold on. Okay, well, Kira, we'll move on over here. I think you get the general tenor of this. Uh, it's anti-government, anti-CNN, since this is highly promoted by the right-wing conservative network, Fox. And since I can't really hear much more, and I think uh, this is not really family viewing, toss it back to you, Kira. All right, I know Susan Rosen's having a hard time hearing me, but wow, that is the prime example uh, of what we're following across the country there. Susan uh, pointed out everything uh, <laughs> plain and clear of what she's dealing with, um, and we will uh, we'll pursue that. That, um, that was interesting. That was a little uh, something we probably didn't expect to see live, uh, but you can obviously see uh, the tensions rising there uh, and both sides, conservative and liberal, that side uh, much more conservative there with the protests.